Well, hello, and uh, today's Saturday, the 5th. I always forget to do that, don't I? Look at the date before I come on a vid. Um, so, there we go, it's Saturday, and uh, we're uploading a load more. So here's another 10 for you, okay? 10, all over the place. Uh, there's uh, one of these is in Middlesbrough, one of these is in uh, Norfolk, uh, Kings Lynn, one of these is down in Kingston-upon-Thames in near London. Um, they're getting everywhere. Now, we still haven't... Look at the video I did the other day. I won't go into the now to bore you. Um, look at the video I did the other day. Uh, the, one of the last ones I did. And it shows you the map and all the that where we've got people. All right? So, if you want to do this, if you're interested, we're still looking for about a dozen more people. That's all we need now. And we're certainly looking for someone over in Cornwall. And we're certainly looking for someone over in um, uh, Middle Wales and North Wales. And maybe sort of westy wales uh, northern ireland uh, we haven't got there yet um we did have a couple of people contact us from northern ireland but uh they didn't join the site you've got to join the site it's not about getting money out of you it's about making you a customer if you're a customer then we know your address is verified and we know you're not pulling up long cap simple as that really um so i'm not worried about the money off you go and buy something for a pound it don't matter it just just become a customer you know we can't let you do this if you're not a customer. That's, that's, the, that's, the, that's the first rule, and it, and it ain't going to be broken. So there you are. Um, right, so without further ado, let's get on to where the next lot are going. Oh, I just want to say, just quickly, it has come to my attention, and I just think I ought to say this. It has come to my attention that there are a, a few Facebook groups and stuff. Um, I suppose you could call them hate groups, that kind of thing. Um, anyway, there's, a, there's an awful lot of people. It's causing a lot of controversy in various places. Unfortunately, a lot of these people don't come forward. So uh, we can't sort of discuss it on the comments, etc., which is what I'd love to do. Instead of that, they sort of set up closed hate groups and all that kind of thing. And, whoops. The daisies, there we go. See, again, shows you we're not scripted. What a plonker. So I've only got two, I've, I've only got two things to say to them anyway, to those people. Which is, first and foremost, I don't care because, uh, you know, the mint can't stop this. No one can stop this. This is fully legal and this is what we're doing. And uh, for those people, I mean, part of the what they've been sort of saying is, oh, it's only a publicity stunt for them to get more customers. It's outrageous. Well, of course it is. I've said that right from the beginning. I think my first words were, this is a, this is a publicity stunt. Don't expect anything else. I, I am trying to raise money and awareness for my own business, as well as... You know, the publicity stunt and raising awareness for what they've done with the coins. It's outrageous. 13 coins you can find and the 14th one you have to buy. It's just not on. Now you get it for free. And the second thing I've said to them is, I say to you, to those people is, crack on. Because for as long as you're writing and moaning and complaining and spending all your time bitching about me, then you're leaving someone else alone that probably would have their feelings hurt and, you know, I mean, nowadays, all this cyberbullying, people go and top themselves. Well, that ain't going to be me. And while you're carrying on with me, you're leaving someone like that alone that's a little bit more vulnerable. So, crack on. Anyway, let's get on with the rest of the where they're going. Number 10, Hello, going this out. this is Bungle from Bungle Collects. And we're taking part in the Great British Coin Hunt. And we've got a Peter Rabbit 2019 ready to go into circulation. So, Lady M's, uh, she's shown us one side and shown us the other. So it's been kindly, uh, this event has been kindly put on by Ian at thegreatbritishcoinhunt.com. So we're, it's great to be taking part. This is our very first, um, our very first coin that's going in. We're going to blow up our car tires with it. Um, before we put it in, I just want to say, please do subscribe to our channel, Bungle Collects. Uh, and also the, the, the plug we're going to make, what we want you to do is, uh, uh, my hometown is Middlesbrough. So I really want to celebrate Middlesbrough. So if you have any interest, please go on the Love Middlesbrough website. So lovemiddlesbrough.com and see all the wonderful things that Middlesbrough got to offer. Right, Lady M, off we go. In it, in it goes. It's in. Let's do this thing. So there it goes. It's in. Thank you very much, Ian. Got a free tire in plate. I forgot to say, we're going to put all our 10 coins in Middlesbrough. So this is, we're currently at a Tesco in Middlesbrough blowing up the tyres, it's in circulation, the other nine are all going to be in and around Middlesbrough. Okay, thanks for watching. Ed, my name is Gary Horsfield, I'm in my local pub here. This is 
the 2019 Peter Rabbit and this is for the Great British Coin Hunt and for Mind Over Matter Foundation here we go look there's the coin there you go in that's my first one done 2019 Peter Rabbit for the Great British Coin Hunt and also in for IAH UK in Asda in Ashton. Donate to charity. Uh, which one? Do cancer research. It goes. Please wait for printing to finish and check the coin return for rejected coin. There's a receipt. Not been rejected. First coin gone in. Good morning. I'm at work and this is the Peter Rabbit 50 pence piece. And I'm putting these into circulation for the coin collectors. Here we go. You can see that there. Just like Ian did, didn't go in the first time, just to make sure it's the same coin, look. There you go. <sighs> Still not going in. You try again, third time. There you go. Hooray! And that's on behalf of the Great British Coin Hunt and Mind Over Matter Foundation, which is a lovely little charity run by a good friend of mine called Billy Whitehouse. Thank you. Yeah. Here you go. Oh. <laughs> right, I'm Mark. On behalf of the Great British Coin Hunt, uh, I'm circulating 2019 Peter Rabbits. Um, I'm in a service centre in Surrey. Um, there's the coin. And I'm doing this to raise awareness of multiple cirrhosis. So just film me putting it in. So. my package from the great british coin hunt.co.uk uh, that's me going to open them up and once opened i'll be distributing them around the edinburgh area so let's see what my two packages there we go
So that's from here. There. Hello, this is Bungle from Bungle Collects. We're here as part of the Great British Coinund.com's promotion to get 400 Peter Rabbits into uh, into circulation. So there he is, Peter Rabbit, 2019. Lady Anne's with me. She's uh, she's doing the uh, the camera work today. Hello. So I want to uh, want to say thank you to Ian at the Great British Coinund.com for letting us uh, be part of this uh, this promotion. Also, if you haven't subscribed, please go onto our YouTube channel at Bungle Collects Coins. So please go on YouTube and find us. And uh, I'm here to plug um, Love Middlesbrough. So Middlesbrough's my hometown and it's a great place to live. So have a look on lovemiddlesbrough.com for all the wonderful things that Middlesbrough's got to offer. Right, so we're actually going to give Ian a ring. Let's see whether, let's see if he answers. So I'll put the 10p in first because you need at least 60 pence minimum charge. Can, can you see that, Lady M? Is yeah. it there? Yeah, right, in he goes. Right, let's give Ian a ring. Zero, seven, four, zero, one, zero, zero, eight, zero, zero, four. <laughs> Ian, Ian, it's Bungle. How are you doing? Fantastic. We're just filming our second video, so Peter Rabbit's in here. We've got uh, we've got five seconds left. Cost us sixty pence in total. Thank you. And, and that's it. We're in. So here we are at Middlesbrough Sports Village. We're here to see if we can put another fifty pence into uh, into circulation by putting into one of their vending machines. So here we are inside the Middlesbrough Sports Village. So we've got uh, we've got our next fifty pence, the third one. Lady M, so quite focusing. There we go, spin it back round, champion. So this is gonna go in, do you wanna put it in Lady M so it's in there? So we're doing this um, as part of the greatbritishcoinhunt.com's putting 40, uh, no we're not, we're putting 400 coins into circulation. We're putting all of ours into Middlesbrough because we wanna plug lovemiddlesbrough.com, it's, it's my hometown. So please do um, go on their website, lovemiddlesbrough.com and we're just about to get a toffee crisp, I think. There we go. Thank you very much. So please, lovebiddlesbrough.com. Please subscribe to Bungle Collects on YouTube. Uh, Bungle Collects Coins. And um, also don't forget the greatbritishcoinhunt.com. Thanks very much. Coin number three is in circulation. I'm Norma Claire, and this is the Great British Coin Hunt. Putting into circulation the Peter Rabbit 2019 50 pence coin. putting into circulation a piece of rubber, 2019, 50 pence coin. awareness of pancreatic cancer. Okay, so here we are at the Captain Cook's Birthplace Museum in Stewart's Park in Middlesbrough. And Lady M's got a coin that she's gonna put into this Captain Pug wash. Oh, there we go, there's Peter Rabbit. There's one side and the other. So don't forget to uh, love Middlesbrough. So go on to lovemiddlesbrough.com. So celebrate my hometown and see what uh, what Middles have got to offer. Um, Bungle Collects. That's uh, that's our YouTube channel, Bungle Collects Coins. So please do log on there and subscribe. And also don't forget to take a look at the greatbritishcoinhunter.com. They're the guys who's uh, sponsoring this to put these uh, these into circulation. So. Lady M. Oh, now we need to put a pound in, don't we? So, yeah, so go on, there's, there's, there's Peter Rabbit going in. Yeah. Put that slot in. Oh, oh. no. Oh, no. It's definitely still Peter. Yeah, you can see it goes straight out. Oh, 
God damn it. Oh, that's not going to work, is it? Well, keep going. I'll try the other 50 pence first. No. Nope. Oh, no. It must have to be a pound coin, maybe. It does say accept 50s. Go on, keep trying. See if I can, see, see if I can give you a bit of luck. Right, go on. Right, that's, that's Peter. So show them again. Peter. Oh, no. Oh, it's in. Great. Right, well, that, that, that. 50 pence. It doesn't really matter. Excellent. Right, hang on, hang on. It's one of these, isn't it? All right, no, you just press start. Go on, the lady, have you press start? And he's off. <laughs> so don't forget to please subscribe to Bungle Collects Coins. Uh, you've got uh, the Great British Coin and don't forget Love Middlesbrough. Thanks very much. Okay, so here we are at the Captain Cook's Birthplace Museum in Stewart's Park in Middlesbrough. And Lady M's got a coin that she's going to put into this Captain Pugwash. Oh, there we go. There's Peter Rabbit. There's one side, then the other. So don't forget to uh, love Middlesbrough. So go on to lovemiddlesbrough.com. So celebrate my hometown and see what uh, what Middles have got to offer. Um, Bungle Collects. That's uh, that's our YouTube channel, Bungle Collects Coins. So please do log on there and subscribe. And also don't forget to take a look at the Great British Coin Hunter.com. They're the guys who's uh, sponsoring this to put these uh, these into circulation. So. Lady M. Oh, now we need to put a pound in, don't we? So, yeah, so go on, there's, there's Peter Rabbit going in. Yeah. Put that slot him. in. Oh, oh. no. Oh, no. It's definitely still Peter. Yeah, you can see it comes straight out. Oh, damn it. Oh, that's not going to work, is it? Well, keep going. I'll try the other 50 pence first. No. Nope. Oh, no. It must have to be a pound coin, maybe. It does say accept 50s. Go on, keep trying. See if I can give you a bit of luck. Right, go on then. Right, that's, that's Peter. So show them again. Peter. Oh, oh no! Oh, oh, it's in. Great. Right, well, that, 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 that. 50 pence. Doesn't really matter. Yes. Excellent. Right, right hang on, hang on. It's one of these, isn't it? All right, oh, you just press start. Go on the lady, have you press start? And he's off! <laughs> <laughs> so don't forget to please subscribe to Bungle Collects Coins. Uh, you've got uh, the Great British Coin and .com, and don't forget Love Middlesbrough. Thanks very much. What did you think? Are we doing our best, or are we doing our best to try and make this as fair as possible via the entire country? Literally, anyone. Anyone, no matter who you are, no matter how poor you are, no matter how rich you are, no matter what you do for a living, no matter if you're a cleaner, no matter if you're shoveling the, sh the crap off the roads, no matter if you're a dustman, no matter if you're a secretary, or no matter if you're an MD, you have a chance of finding one of these coins. And someone asked me what they were worth, and I said, the moment these coins go into the machine, they've got an all they're immediately worth 100 quid each. The moment they go into a machine, there are people out there that will immediately now, that I'm, I'm getting emails from people saying, I want to buy these, I want to buy one, I want to buy one, I want it in my collection. You know, so these 500 coins, there are those people that say, oh, they're, it's rubbish and all the rest of it. That's fine, it doesn't matter. This is a great publicity stunt, that's all it is. And it's about giving 400 people the chance to find one for free in their change. The moment that goes in the thing, it's worth 100 quid. You mark my words on that one. Right, this has been Ian, www.greatbritishcoinhand.com and if you'd like to see us do this on all the other coins, there are 34 more coins that have not been released into circulation. Would you like them released into circulation? Would you like the chance of finding a snowman, a gruffalo, the RAF coin, Spitfire, Vulcan bomber, Sea King, uh, the RAF badge and the one I've, and the lightning? Um, what about Frankenstein? Would you like to find Frankenstein in your change? Because they won't release that one. How about Armistice? How about D-Day? How about Stephen Hawkins? How about any of the five from the sets or the ten from the sets, the two new sets they bought out with the five coins in each set, D-Day in one set, Q Gardens in another set? All of these, would you like all of these released into circulation so you have the chance of finding one? That's what this is about. That kind of let's get it going. We are the Great British Coin Hunt. It's in our interests for the Great British Coin Hunt to continue. If the Great British Coin Hunt just fizzles out, then we might fizzle out. And I don't like the sound of that. So we want to keep it going. And we can't keep it going 
without your support at the end of the day. So if you want to see these coins come into circulation, now imagine if we did 400 coins multiplied by 10, that's 4,000, and there's 35 of them. So that's uh, 4, 8, 12,000 and another 2, 14,000 coins have a chance of going into circulation. And the decision on that is actually yours. You support what we're doing, we put those coins into circulation. If you don't support what we're doing, then obviously we don't. I'm not just going to throw money away for the sake of it. <coughs> so, excuse me. <clears throat> If this works for the Peter Rabbit 2019, we will do it for another one. And if that works, we'll do it for another one. And maybe even we'll let you choose, you know, um, which coin we're going to do it to next. And that's a bit of a buzz, isn't it? How, you know, how amazing is that? You actually having the choice of which coin we release into circulation. And there's nothing the Treasury can do about it. There's nothing the Mint can do about it because it is 100% fully legal. Remember, every time you buy a package coin, no matter how much you pay for it, the coin has a legal tender of the amount. In this case, the coin has a legal tender of 50p. So we ripped open the packets and we spent them, or we are spending them. And the packets themselves have then been turned into ephemera. There's only so many of those available. Well, there was only 500 available. There's a lot less now. But if you'd like one of those packets, signed and numbered, then please go to our website www.thegreatbridgecoinhunt.com and on the first page you'll see my ugly mug it's got the investments there etc etc but it's also got the listing right there in front of you for the packets if you'd like to support that and have one of those empty rubbish packets that ordinarily would be considered rubbish that we've now turned into collectible ephemera okay anybody out there wants to use any of our material please do feel free uh, just credit us for it and if there's anybody out there in the media world that would like an interview give us a ring okay thanks a lot and thanks for supporting us and we'll let you know how peter rabbit's getting on around the rest of the country tomorrow and the next day as more and more videos come in thank you